Welcome to SNS Railroad, and today we're going to be looking at my new N scale layout and why I switched from HO scale and got rid of all that progress. First reason for getting rid of HO scale was that the curves were way too tight. I just wanted to run bigger locomotives. I also would like like more room for area because everything was really crammed in. I did not get as much room as I hoped to do things. I barely even had room for a three car siding. Don't worry though, all not all of the HO scale layout is lost. I only traded in some of it to fund the new N scale layout. Still a DC layout on the bottom. It might even be better than the last layout I had. You might be wondering about the pieces of wood on the side of the layout. That is for the Woodland Scenics um, plaster cloth that I'm going to do. The wood is going to retain in newspaper for me to put the plaster cloth over. I will be connecting these layouts by a bridge. And there will be a incline coming up through here. And then I'll have two, about two inches of Woodland Scenics riser. Also on this side, I will be doing the exact same. I just didn't want to have to build a turnaround loop with a tight space. And I didn't want to have to buy an expensive turntable and waste space putting in a siding. I've also added to my railroad collection, showing off a rail connector, just missing one bolt, which it's pretty much missing two bolts because of found that broken. So. Over here, I try to grind off all the um, rust, and it looks pretty good. A fresh spike that I found laying around. And some J's. I think it's supposed to keep the rail from sliding around when doing maintenance. Don't quote me on that. So I'm moving my collection from upstairs to downstairs. The latest addition to my N-Scale layout is this small switcher. I'm very excited to run this locomotive once I get the layout up and going. Here are two box cars that are brand new. Never really done a full layout. Not were used in my service yet. Just been pulling around, testing them out. Here I have an older locomotive. I think it's a batch in Spectrum, so it's pretty good. I accidentally broke off a coupler, but that's all right, get it fixed. As you can see here, I've been experimenting with weathering. This is the first car in the fleet to get weathering. I think it looks pretty darn nice. Here we have an N-scale high hood. It's been corroded quite a bit, but nothing I can't fix and get a railroad shop to fix because I don't know what I'm doing. It does receive power though, just doesn't drive. One of the major themes for this layout, or not really theme, but cargo that I'll be carrying is box cars. I think it's really limited to the imagination of what you could put in them. I will also be continuing on coal and lumber. The lumber operation that I had going with the HO scale layout has not completely ended and will survive on in the new N scale layout. 